CRPS type 1 treated with topical creams. Chronic regional pain syndrome type 1 was previously called Sudex dystrophy. It's a chronic pain state which is basically very difficult to treat. Most of the time it's refractory to whatever we as doctors try to do. This is also clear from all the guidelines. There is not one treatment for CRPS type 1 which is uniformly accepted as the best and an effective treatment with acceptable side effects. So each doctor has to find the best treatment for each individual patient. In our clinic we are specialized in treating neuropathic pain and we often see patients with CRPS type 1 which are treatment resistant to whatever other doctors tried. Mostly we start with a local cream combination. We start one week with amitriptyline 10% cream and afterwards if there is not a clear partial or full response we add ketamine 10% cream and then we proceed adding DMSO cream 50%. The latter one, DMSO, is a cream which enhances the penetration of analgesics into the skin. This combination of three creams in the next patient example led to a clear diminished pain sensation. It decreased from around a score of 9 to no pain at all. Listen to the story of the patient. And next time consider topical creams. Hi Rob, hi David. You are here because you are suffering from severe pain in the legs during some years. Could you say something about that? Since 2008 I am suffering from severe pains in my leg and my feet and these pain states were so severe that the neurologist could not treat them properly and the diagnosis was CRPS type 1. And uh, who is that ontstaan? The syndrome most probably started after a fall where I traumatized my feet. Some months later the severe pain complaints started. The pain become, became intense and even more intense and uh, nothing could really lessen the pain. So what was the quality of the pain? It was a burning and stinging and extremely irritative pain, as if sharp objects were hidden deep in my leg. Then your neurologist started to treat you with gabapentin and maximal dosages and what happened? Well, gabapentin and also the other drugs I had to take really didn't help me at all. It just initially the pain became less a bit, but after some weeks it increased again. So nothing really helped. Okay, then you came in our institute and we started with the first topical treatment with a cream of amitriptyline 5%. What did you notice? Well, uh, at first I felt a very slight decrease in pain, it softened the pain and after a while the pain decreased from say a 9 to a 6 on the numeric rating scale. Then we prescribed a second cream, ketamine 10% cream, and could you tell us what happened? I felt very relieved because the pain decreased further and when the third cream was applied, the DMSO cream, actually the pain vanished totally. So by the end of the three creams there was no pain anymore. For intractable pains, topical creams need to be considered. We have gained experience with amitriptyline and ketamine cream in combination with DMSO cream. This was a patient presentation from the Institute for Neuropathic Pain in the Netherlands.